So I used to try to hide the weed. They find it. One time he put me in the cuffs, put gloves on, went in my pants. They searching the car, they grab you. They put it all on your pants, then they wanna search your ass crack, you feel me? Hey, it's your boy Bob Man D-Lo, aka Bizar, man. And we doing first with Rap TV, man. Yeah. First thing you should know about Port Salerno. It ain't really no killing and all that going on. You know what I'm saying? It's just the whole motive just be who gonna get the most motion. Who gonna get rich. 2019, I was writing out beats I heard on the radio and shit. So but I came home on probation and shit. You know, people call the police. People saying, oh, it's, oh, it's, oh, it's drug activity. All kind of crazy shit going on. So one day we was going live on the radio. We turn on the street, it just ain't feel right. There was a lot of police in the area, so we like, damn, what the fuck? So they came through the back. There was one back door. They blew that bitch open with like the fucking C4, bro. They didn't find shit in there, though. They bust that bitch down. I was over with after that. A couple of us from the hood just started going to jail after that. They started just picking us up one by one. First way to make it out the trenches, so you gotta find what, whatever God got planned for you to do, bro. That's really. You just gotta find it, find your talent, save your money and go towards it, you feel me? Everybody ain't gonna be able to make it in the street, so you might have to get a job. Sacrifice right quick. First reaction to get in with me going viral. Shit was crazy, just looking at the phone and seeing big artists reposted and freestyle on the beat and shit. Like, that shit crazy, bro, you feel me? Yeah, my first, I was really surprised though, for real, for real. First time I got in trouble at school, we got caught doing some shit that was like, when school was closed type shit, you feel me? Like they came back, we was tripping, bro. I think we was just smoking weed on that shit. We seen a janitor the week. We took our running, you feel me? First time going to juvenile detention. Like when I was 15, like it was, I ain't really know how to deal with the police. You know, I used to panic and shit. So I used to try to hide the weed and shit. They find it. One time he put me in the cuffs, put gloves on, went in my pants. You feel me? Like shit crazy, bro. They searching the car, they grabbing dick. They put it all on your pants, your drawers. They down there want to search your ass crack. You feel me? For real, this shit was crazy, bro. First time a crowd rapped my song word for word. I ain't gonna lie, it was the first show at Tallahassee eight, nine months ago. I wouldn't say it was many like phones recording, you know what I'm saying? But you could tell like they, everybody in there singing it. But now it's like, as soon as I walk through, they start recording. You feel me? Like, <laughs> I would say first time dodging the Senate. I can't even speak on that shit. You feel me? Some shit. Yeah, no. First rapper that I looked up to, probably Wiz Khalifa. With well, Khalifa, you put them on just, you know what I'm saying? Smoke weed, get some money, you feel me? Fuck back, bitch, you got your good day. Like, that's just his vibe. I fuck, bro. <laughs> what, well, first, first time scraping the pot? <laughs> scraping the pot. <laughs> I probably ain't really get in the trenches till about 15, 16. First time a fan got out of pocket. All the fans been straight, bro. You know, they be a little too excited sometimes, but they all right. Heard two, three shows ago, it was crazy. We leaving female beating on the car like, hello. The crazy, right? The first time a counter and a hater. Well, it playing that though, you feel me? I can't remember the first time. Is it too much, y'all? Uh, you feel me? I understand everybody ain't going to be, oh, I love this. I don't even want that because that's fate. You feel me? When you down bad, that's when people love you like that. When you up and you got shit going, you know, people got shit to say. He do, 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 you know what I'm saying? I don't even worry about that shit. That shit don't do nothing to me, bro, I promise. First way to boss up your life, you gotta get that mindset right. It take a different kind of mindset to be a boss. You gotta know how to sacrifice, stay around, complete the mission. You feel me? You can't get thrown off by nothing. You can't get distracted. That's just boss mentality, bro and to make everybody else bosses around you. First altercation I got in at school, I don't know what made me do it, but some it, the dude was on the monkey bars, he was going across, and I jumped, and I was like behind him on the monkey bars, and I like kicked his ass in the back, and he like flew like this, fell, and he 
He, his back of the head hit the slide onto my blood everywhere. Bro, these people down there want to charge me by that shit. I always remember that. It was like, it's like a couple stories, kindergarten, I remember. I know I had pants, somebody too, they down there wanting to sexually charge me, bro. <laughs> First time I got expelled, yeah, that was 10th grade. I had, uh, got caught with that damn weed. It wasn't like I was in school campus with the weed, you feel me? Well, I'm all here selling the weed. Like, shit was in my car, I'm leaving school. He on the golf cart, so he like drive by. I got the window cracked like this much. So he drive by, phew. I watch him slide, all right? The boy I wasn't looking. So then he come back, doo, 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 doo. I look I'm like, oh shit. God, like, bro, you ain't here smoking, bro? I'm like, bro, do you see any smoke? I'm not smoking. He's like, all right, bro, well, I smell a strong odor of marijuana, bro. You mind if you just, just pull to the side for me, man? So like, he telling me pull to the side. I'm trying to hurry up, cause I got the weed in the door right here. So I'm trying to hurry up and pull to the side. But he like, walk faster with the car. He like, hold on, no, bro. Don't, 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 don't go too fast. I'm trying to watch you. I'm like, damn. I go to pull to the side. I like, fuck, I couldn't grab the shit. So I let him search. He went past the shit, bro. He opened the door. He looking so hard, he closed that door. I'm like, oh shit, he ain't gonna find it. He searched all the rest of the car. He come back to the front cause he wanted to open the trunk. And that's when he seen the shit. He looked, he like, oh, it's right here. Last bit of weed, they spell him about that shit. I was going 10, 11. I came back at 12 and then went to jail and I ain't even finished 12. I fucked up high school bad, but. First thing I bought when I signed my deal. The first thing I did, I gave my mama like 25,000. I didn't get the charge till uh, two months later or some shit like that. First project got me out here too slippery. You walk behind me, bust your ass, it drip leaking everywhere. You saying some big zah shit, that's it. First thing I saw behind bars that I always remember, dude was sitting down and he came, he came behind him with a tray. And just the way he hit him, I think he hit him crazy, like with the corner of the tread. I would turn around, his shit was like dismembered. That was the first time I see like a jaw break, like that bitch really broke, bro. It was kind of like fights going on, like repeatedly and shit. I was already in the mode of like, man, you might want to go ahead and expect whatever in this bitch. It still was like, oh shit. Damn, boy, you got to be on beat in this bitch, that's it. First piece of advice that I give, Keep pushing. Anything you do that's gonna take that grind, you cannot skip that grind. I don't care if you're making clothes, selling draws, you flipping cars, whatever you doing, it gonna take that grind. It don't never just come off the top like that, you feel me? Hey, it's your boy Boss Man, D-Lo, AK Bitzai, man. And you just watched First with Rap TV.